Hey folks, Mike Rowe here, ready to get our hands dirty with a job most people take for granted, making banana chips. It's a fascinating process that starts long before those crispy treats hit your taste buds. You know those sweet and crunchy treats we all love? They're a staple in many households, perfect for snacking or adding a bit of crunch to your meals. Well, it all starts with a tiny seed, or in the banana's case, a bulb. This bulb is the beginning of a long and intricate journey. These bulbs are planted in warm, sunny places often on massive farms that stretch as far as the eye can see. The climate is crucial for the growth of these plants. The soil needs to be rich and well-drained, kind of like what you'd want for your prize-winning tomatoes. Farmers take great care in preparing the soil to ensure it has the right nutrients. Once the bulb is in the ground it doesn't take long for the magic to happen. The transformation from bulb to plant is truly a sight to behold. The banana plant starts to grow, pushing up through the soil with incredible speed. It's almost as if you can see it growing before your eyes. In just a few weeks, it looks more like a tree than a plant, with huge leaves fanning out like giant green hands. These leaves are essential for the plant's growth. These leaves soak up the sun's energy, fueling the growth of the fruit we're all waiting for, the banana bunch. The process of photosynthesis is in full swing here. It's a sight to behold, folks, a single plant yielding enough bananas to feed a family. Each bunch is carefully monitored to ensure it reaches its full potential. And believe me, when you're standing in the middle of a banana plantation, it feels like you're surrounded by a sea of green giants. The sheer scale of these plantations is awe-inspiring. It's humbling, really, to think about the journey these bananas take from the farm to our snack bags. From planting to harvesting and finally processing, each step is a testament to the hard work and dedication of the farmers. The bananas are carefully picked by hand, ensuring only the best ones make it to the next stage. They are then loaded onto trucks and transported to processing facilities. At the processing facilities, the bananas are washed, peeled, and sliced before being fried to perfection. This is where the magic happens, turning fresh bananas into the delicious chips we all enjoy. Finally, the banana chips are packaged and sent to stores, ready for us to enjoy. So next time you grab a handful of banana chips, remember the incredible journey they took to get to you. Now, these banana plants are tough cookies. They are resilient and can thrive in various conditions. They can handle a lot of sun and rain, enduring the elements with remarkable strength, and they grow at an astonishing rate. You can almost see them stretching towards the sky day by day, but they still need a little TLC from the farmers. These dedicated individuals play a crucial role in the growth process. These folks work tirelessly, keeping the plants healthy and hydrated. They ensure that each plant gets the right amount of water. They know just when to add fertilizer, providing essential nutrients that help the plants flourish and how to protect the plants from pests and diseases. This is vital to ensure the bananas grow without any hindrance. It's a delicate balance, folks, but these farmers are pros. They have honed their skills over years of experience. As the weeks turn into months, the banana bunches start to take shape. You can see the tiny bananas forming. They hang down from the plant, protected by a thick, waxy skin. This skin shields them from the elements. At first, they're green and firm, not yet ready for consumption. But as they ripen, something amazing happens. The transformation is a sight to behold. The green gives way to a vibrant yellow, signaling that the bananas are nearing their peak. And the bananas become soft and sweet. This is when they are at their most delicious. The air fills with a sweet tropical aroma, letting you know it's almost harvest time. The anticipation builds as the farmers prepare for the final step. Harvesting bananas is a carefully timed dance. Pick them too early, and they'll be starchy and bland. Wait too long, and they'll be too ripe for transport. The farmers know exactly when the time is right, using their keen eyes and years of experience to judge the perfect moment. Once the bananas are ready, it's time to call in the harvest crew. These skilled workers use a sharp machete to carefully cut the heavy bunches from the plant. It's a team effort, with one person supporting the weight of the bunch, while another makes the cut. The bunches are then lowered gently to the ground, where they are carefully inspected for any imperfections. Only the best bananas will make the cut for our delicious chips. With the harvest complete, the real journey begins. The bananas, freshly picked and still carrying the morning dew, are carefully gathered by the farmers. Each bunch is handled with care, ensuring that the fruits remain in perfect condition for the next stage of their journey. 
The banana bunches are loaded onto trucks ready to be transported to the factory where they'll be transformed into those crispy, crunchy chips we all know and love. The workers move swiftly, their practiced hands making quick work of the loading process. Each truck is packed to the brim, ensuring that no space is wasted. It's a long journey, often over bumpy roads, but these bananas are tough. The trucks navigate through winding paths and uneven terrain, carrying their precious cargo towards its destination. The journey is a testament to the resilience of both the fruit and the people who ensure its safe passage. They've weathered storms and scorching sun, so a little road trip is nothing for them. These bananas have seen it all, from torrential rains to the blazing heat of the midday sun. Their journey to the factory is just another chapter in their story of endurance. And let me tell you, the inside of these trucks is a sight to behold. Piled high with golden yellow bananas, it's a veritable sea of fruit. The sight is almost mesmerizing, a testament to the abundance of nature. It's like stepping into a tropical paradise with the sweet scent of ripe bananas filling the air. The sunlight filters through the gaps, casting a warm glow on the bananas, making them look even more inviting. The aroma is intoxicating, a sweet reminder of the tropical origins of these fruits. You can almost feel the warmth of the sun that ripened these fruits to perfection. Each banana carries with it the essence of the sun, the warmth that helped it grow and mature. It's a connection to the natural world that is both humbling and inspiring. It's a reminder that even though we're about to get down to business in the factory, this whole process starts with nature's bounty. The factory may be where the magic happens, but it all begins in the fields under the open sky. The hard work of the farmers and the generosity of the land are what make it all possible. And that's something to be respected. The journey from farm to factory is a collaborative effort, a partnership between man and nature. It's a process that deserves our appreciation and respect. For without it, we wouldn't have the delicious banana chips we enjoy today. Section 5. Inside the Banana Chip Factory. A first look. All right, folks, we've made it to the Banana Chip Factory. And let me tell you, this place is buzzing with activity. Trucks loaded with bananas are pulling up, and workers are busy unloading these precious fruits. The air is thick with anticipation, a mix of sweet banana aroma and the hum of machinery ready to get to work. Now, this isn't your typical factory. Sure, there's metal and machines, but there's also a certain energy here, a sense of purpose. These folks know they're not just making any old snack food, they're crafting a treat that brings joy to people all over the world. And that pride shows in every step of the process. Section 6 Wash and Peel Getting the bananas ready for slicing The first stop for our bananas is the cleaning station. Here, they're given a thorough wash to remove any dirt or debris they might have picked up on their journey from the farm. Think of it as a spa day for bananas, getting them squeaky clean and ready for the next stage of their transformation. Next up, it's time for peeling. Now you might be picturing a bunch of folks with banana peels flying everywhere, but this is a high-tech operation. Specialized machines gently remove the peels, separating them from the fruit with incredible precision. It's mesmerizing to watch, like a well-choreographed dance between man and machine. Section 7 the art of the slice, making the perfect banana chip. Now that our bananas are peeled and prepped, it's time for the main event slicing. These aren't your average kitchen knives, folks. We're talking about industrial strength slicers that can handle hundreds of bananas per minute. They slice the bananas into thin, uniform pieces, the perfect thickness for a satisfying crunch. And let me tell you, the sound of those slicers is music to my ears. It's the sound of progress, the sound of deliciousness in the making. Each slice represents a tiny piece of the journey from the farm to the factory, all leading up to this moment. Section 8, a bath of flavor, infusing the chips with deliciousness. Now, here's where things get really interesting. The banana slices take a dip in a flavorful bath, a secret recipe that gives them that irresistible taste. Some folks like their chips sweet, others prefer a salty kick. Whatever your preference, there's a flavor bath out there just waiting to tantalize your taste buds. It's like a giant mixing bowl, with the banana slices tumbling around soaking up all that deliciousness. The aroma is intoxicating, a blend of sweet, salty, and savory that makes your mouth water. It's hard to resist grabbing a handful right then and there, but trust me, the best is yet to come. Section 9. Drying Out transforming slices into crunchy chips. 
After their flavor bath, the banana slices head to the drying room. Now this isn't your grandma's clothesline, folks. We're talking about massive ovens that use carefully controlled heat and airflow to remove excess moisture from the slices. This process is crucial for achieving that signature crunch we all love in a banana chip. It's like watching alchemy in action, as the soft, pliable slices slowly transform into crispy golden chips. The air is thick with the warm, comforting scent of banana bread, making you feel like you've stepped into your grandma's kitchen. It's a sensory overload in the best possible way. Section 10. Quality Control. Ensuring every bag is perfect. Before our banana chips are deemed ready for packaging, they undergo a rigorous quality control check. Every single chip is inspected by hand, ensuring that only the best of the best make it into the bag. They're checking for color, texture, and of course taste. Only the chips that meet the highest standards earn the right to bear the company's name. It's a testament to the dedication and passion of everyone involved in the process. From the farmers who nurtured the banana plants to the factory workers who transformed the fruit into these delicious chips, every step is driven by a commitment to quality. Section 11, from factory to you, the journey's end. And there you have it, folks, the incredible journey of the banana chip from a tiny bulb planted in the ground to a crispy, flavorful snack enjoyed by millions around the world. It's a story of hard work, ingenuity, and a deep respect for the natural world. So the next time you reach for a bag of banana chips, take a moment to appreciate the journey they took to get to you. It's a journey that's both delicious and inspiring, a true testament to the power of human ingenuity and the bounty of nature. And that's something worth savoring.